How long does he stand this way? These are among the most famous feet in the world. They belong to Edward Villela, considered the crown prince of American dance, who's now moved to Miami to direct the new Miami City Ballet. Today, his footprints were added to the Miami Beach Walkway of Stars. It was an official welcome for Valella and his troupe. Later, the dance company moved into their new studios on Lincoln Road and took their first public plie. Rotate our upper bodies to the right and simultaneously to the left. There are 19 dancers in the company who were handpicked by Valella from 400 who auditioned. Five of them are from South Florida, like Miami-trained Marilena Mencia, who left a German ballet company to dance with this group, and 20-year-old Maria Verdeja of Miami. This is her first chance at the big time. This is an opportunity of a lifetime. This is what we've been waiting for all our lives ever since I was small, waiting for this to happen. And it finally happened today, August 11th. I'm not going to forget this date. It was also an exciting day for the community arts activists who sparked the idea for a major regional ballet company in the first place. This is a dream come true. In fact, when they did the first plie, there were tears in my eyes because it is something that will last forever and that we will give to our children and our children's children. The incredible thing is there is already tremendous community support for this organization even before they dance their first step. Organizers tell me almost $1 million in community funds have been pledged and over 3,000 season subscriptions have been sold. Valella says he's thrilled with the support so far and hopes the company will be the catalyst for a South Florida arts explosion. That's why he chose Miami Beach as the group's headquarters. This is an artist's community, and that's where we should be. We should be part of the evolution of Miami Beach, Miami, Southern Florida, and the entire state of Florida.